Hi, my name is David and in today's video I'm going to give you um, a quick heat press 101. Um, this is our ghost white toner showroom and I want to quickly give you some insights on the heat presses that we are using here and on the heat presses that you can use um, with our ghost white toner cartridges for your laser printers. I'm going to start over there. This is the typical um, auto clamp heat press. Auto clamp means it opens automatically. This um, model uh, has a rotatable table which makes it easier for you to place your garment and to place your design without burning your fingers. You can push the table back in, close the heat press. The heat press locks automatically using a magnet. Once the time on the heat press is up, it will open automatically for you so that you can start peeling your design. This sort of heat press uh, is considered as usually one of the cheaper ones or a beginner one. Um, it features a digital display, um, a digital timer and the auto opening feature. Um, this heat press is perfect if you want to start a transfer business. Um, it will be perfectly suitable for all kinds of toner transfer applications using ghost white toner or sublimation applications. Okay, let's check out the next one. This one is a um, so-called swing away model. That means that you can swing away the heat plate of your heat press completely from the bottom plate. Um, this heat press also features a screwable bottle plate, bottom plate which means you can higher and lower the bottom plate by turning the screw down below here. This is very convenient if you want to place items of different thickness under the press maybe a leather bag, a leather apron, or even pieces of wood or cork uh, or thicker cotton hoodies or things like that. You can easily adjust the pressure um, by removing the base plate. This press has a very um, good rotation um, um, and it is very durable. It's considered as one of the more professional models and requires a bit more investment than this one would. You can close the press by pushing it down quickly. These models are usually available as manual close and open as well as automatic close and open. This one is a, a manual close and open so I will have to open it manually. It features a digital timer and a digital thermometer as well to set your temperature. All the heat presses that you will be using um, with toner transfer require you to have a temperature from at least 160 degrees Celsius up to 200 um, or lower 180, something like that. So if you want to start a transfer business using toner transfer and ghost white toner, make sure that your heat press can at least do 160 degrees Celsius. All right, I open it back up and now I can swing away and I can, you know, take my t-shirt or my design. This is a um, very professional heat press, um, very durable model and really, really good if you want to spend some money on something that lasts you quite long. Okay, um, so we all know that it's great to create rounded items like bottles or mugs um, or all kinds of that. For this kind of application, you would need a mug press. A mug press is a small heat press um, that usually comes with a round inlay. I'm going to turn it over so you guys can see it. With a round inlay, with a handle to close it, a digital thermometer and a timer. Muck presses um, are usually really cheap, so this is usually an investment uh, that you can easily undertake. And many, many muck presses allow you to take out the inlet, take it away, and replace it with different inlets of either smaller or thicker size, or even conic uh, inlays that allow you to personalize conic items, like for example, I've got one example here. Um, like an insulated coffee mug, uh, um, coffee to go mug. So this is really cool because you can um, change um, the inlays of your um, mug heat press to personalize different items. Um, for mug personalization with ghost white toner uh, and toner transfer, you need a one step multi trans. Um, hard surface transfer paper. I have made several videos on hard surface transfer um, which you can check out on our channel um, uh, for more info on that. 
These heat presses are mainly used um, for t-shirt transfer or any kind of textile and garment transfer. With Ghost White Toner for garment transfer, you will use a two-step transfer paper and I've also made a lot of videos on personalization of different um, textile products um, that I would like you to check out on our channel. I've got one more heat press on my workspace. I'm going to make some room here um, before I go into detail that. And this is called a so-called multi-purpose heat press. Um, this is a special model that can be used for several applications, pretty much like the mock press with the different inlays. A multi-purpose uh, heat press usually comes with different bottom and top parts. You can unscrew the bottom, take it off and replace it with a different bottom part, for example like this one, which would be for a cap press also using a rounded head. You can easily take off the top part, leave it on the side and replace it with a different top part, for example this flat one, for small items like shirt sleeves or um, pockets, shirt pockets, stuff like that. These kinds of heat presses are usually considered a bit more expensive as well, but they give you multiple opportunities of personalization of different objects uh, and materials. For example, if you take off this cap press rounded bottom part, you can replace it um, with either a really tiny, small or a little bigger bottom plate um, for personalization of um, small areas of um, your garment or um, of uh, uh, other items. This is really, really convenient uh, as it allows you to only hit the garment with heat um, in the place where you have your transfer sheet and where you want the heat to be applied. The, the height between the bottom plate and the head can be altered by a screw down here. There are different models of this type of heat press in the market um, and they are all very convenient, coming usually with one or two or three different heads to use. So far on our little heat press 101. So we have everything in the world of heat presses from flat lay easy heat presses that come in sizes 38 by 38 up to 40 by 50, mock presses with different inlays uh, and multi-purpose presses that allow you to personalize round items, um, bolts, caps and small uh, parts of items. Not all the heat presses that we have shown here are available in our online shop. We um, have different or other products as well um, and I would like you to check it out. Um, but the general message is that with Ghost White Toner and the transfer media that we suggest you to use, um, you can use any heat press in the market um, to do your personalization business, whether it is on hard surfaces or whether it is on textiles. So whatever heat press you guys already have, um, please put a comment down below. Let me know about your good or bad experiences and um, how you like to do toner transfer and what kind of heat press you like best. In the meantime, I say thank you for watching and see you next time.